Hey guys, it's a new motion, and for this episode, I'm gonna show you how to make a bucket server with Hamachi. So first, what you're gonna do is go to bucket.org and press enter. Then what you're gonna do is go to the right and download the latest recommended build right here. Okay, after it's done loading, click on the download craft bucket recommended build, in that's in the green right here, and. My computer's derping. My computer's derping. Okay, after that, download it. Okay. Download it. Download it. Okay. After it's done downloading, wait for it to be done downloading. And then while it's after wait after when you're waiting for it to be downloaded, go Google search Hamachi and press enter. Then go to f find the website that says download log me in Hamachi. Okay. So after downloading, check the conditions of use and download the unmanaged version. I won't I won't download it because I already have it but for you you need to install it and yeah okay after you're done installing go to your desktop or wherever you want the server to be and make a uh, make a new folder okay so go to your desktop or wherever you want your server and make a folder and you can name it whatever you want for this tutorial I'll name it I'll name it minecraft server Okay, after that, open it up and get your and get the craft bucket and drag it into the the folder. And then rename it craft bucket. Take out the rest and just make it craft bucket by itself. Okay, now what you're going to want to do is um go to your Amachi and open it click network and create a new network name it whatever you want I'll name this one tutorial123 and I'll make the password password what it's been taken okay I made it and then if you want your other friends to join your server you have to give them the name of this network and the passes so for them to join is they have to install Hamachi click network and click join an existing network okay now what you're gonna want to do is go back to your Minecraft server right click it click new and then click text document then then open it up and, and then you have to paste this thing that will be in the description okay this is what is in the this is this is what you're gonna need to copy and paste if you have more than if you have more RAM than if you want to allocate more than one gigabyte of RAM just change this to 2048 I'll put I'll put more ver more numbers in the description depending on how much RAM you want but I have a limited amount of RAM so I'm just gonna allocate one so after that click file save as and name it run dot bat b a t make sure you also click save as type all files now you can save it and close this now you can delete this text document and then run and then double click on the run dot bat then it should be loading and then it's it's normal if you get some errors because it will it will generate the new things that you're missing. Okay, we'll wait on this to load, and I'll t and I'll come back when it's done. Okay, as you can see here, it's done loading. After that, you can just type stop, and then it will stop the server and close it. Okay, um, after it's done closing, you'll see that it generated a lot of new things. The first thing that you want to go edit is your server is find the server properties file. If you if you can't if you if you can't open it with just with just a double click, what you're going to want to do is right click it 
click properties then what find the open with make sure it says notepad if it doesn't click change and find in the other programs find notepad and press o and click on it and press okay then click apply and then it should open up with notepad now here what you're going to want to do is just change the settings to whatever you want now if you to make your friends connect open up your amachi right click your ip click copy ipv4 address then close it find the server ip and cop and paste it right into there so after you're done with that you can close it and you're basically done with the server also if you want to add a plugin just download it here I'll show you right now I'll show you right when it's done loading okay guys I'm back and I'm gonna for this tutorial I'm gonna show you how to get MCMMO if you want to add plugins to your server so what you're gonna do is go to your plugin find the download click it then download it again and and then after that make sure it's done loading go to your plugins folder then just drag and drop it into the plugins folder after and then you are basically done adding the the plugin so now you are done and if you want to start up the server anytime just double click the run dot bat and it should and it should load up correctly to see if you have the to see if you have the plugin installed correctly after it's done loading click type pl and it should show your plugins if it's in green you have installed it correctly but if it's red you ha it's either outdated or you need another plugin to to have it work okay whenever you want to save or stop the server type save dash all then stop make sure you do this or or you might not save your world okay so that's basically it to make a minecraft bucket server i'm new if you like this video be sure to give it a thumbs up and if you want to see more be sure to subscribe i'm new motion and i'm out